Hello beautiful people, welcome back to another video. This is Soho California Vintage and I'm going to be actually unbagging a bag that I got at the community and this feels, to be honest with you, this feels predominantly like craft but, oh look at an earring, I think I have that earring too. Hopefully we have pairs, pairs available and let's just dive right in, okay? Um, hopefully we get some silver and maybe gold. Yeah. yeah. Oh, this is cool. Oh, wow. This is really cool. Okay. So I'm going to put it to the side and we are just about to dab in. So this says alpaca, Mexico. So it has the mother of pearl inlay. This is an earring. I don't know if we have the other one. Earrings I'll put to the side. And if I don't have the pair, if they're non-sterling, um, they are going to go in the craft. So this is actually interesting. We have a silver hope earring. And we have a grain acrylic bead. What appears to be um, a faux carnelian. And a faux jade. This one's fun though. Ooh, look at this one. This one has all the pearls. I don't believe it's silver, though. Hmm. We're going to put that with the um, single earrings. Here's another um, copper-colored. It's like the back of a pen. I don't believe this is an earring. It's too thick. Oh, like, okay, so we have the pair to this one. That's very, very good. So I'm going to put this together with this one. And if anybody's interested, feel free to email me at um, Soho California Vintage at gmail.com. It's the title of my YouTube name, and you just add at gmail.com. Um, I won't be giving prices. You know, this stuff is usually just like a few dollars. So feel free to email me. Here's a a bow ring. But um, this this doesn't feel comfortable. So I think I might I might put that with craft. Here's a single earring, white with purple flowers. Okay. There's another earring. It looks like, okay, so it goes in like this. This is cute. This is really, really cute. Hopefully we have the pair on that one. So Bronze is sitting up at the window and he is making weird sounds because he sees birds. <laughs> and he wants to get them. <laughs> Bronze, if you guys are new to the channel, um, Bronze is my cat. I have two, Bronze and Silver. Let's smooth this over. Also, if you're new, um, subscribe. It's free. It doesn't cost anything. And um, please give a thumbs up. And if you give a thumbs down, that's still okay because it still helps my algorithm and you're viewing my content. So thank you. <laughs> um, okay, so here we have an Asian, an Asian um, pocket watch. Huh. Wonder what that says. I know I have subscribers that can read that. And there's a dragon on it. That's very, very cool. Very, very cool. Okay. Okay, so here we have what appears to be an onyx or obsidian piece of stone. And I'm wondering if this is silver. Mm. Mm. I don't think so. Yeah, it's not. But it's still cute. Here we have a quartz clear crystal. We'll put that with um, crafting. I feel like it's really, really, I guess the lighting is okay. 
I feel like it's a little bit dim. Okay, so what is going on here? So I guess the back of the watch dropped out. Oh, and there's some writing. It says, uh, well, wait a minute. This is this is a really really cool design. I'm just interested to see what it says. Um, what it says. Japan base metal. Oh, Seiko. This is a Seiko. This is a Seiko. Does it work? The clasp. Huh. <gasps> it does. Oh, okay. I think there was another class, a safety class right there. And it came off. But if somebody has like a small little watch face, that that would still be, you know, good to um you know, fix it up. Let me show you guys really fast. What uh let's see if the Let's see if the print comes out. You guys see that? Seiko, Japan. Okay. Okay. Here we have a gold tone um, bangle. It is not gold. This is really, really clean. So, is there any maker's mark? No, but look at the three stones right there. How does this open up? Oh, there we go. See? It's a, nice, it's a very nice clasp. Oh, that locks good. I like that. There's just very minimal wear at the bottom. But that's a nice bracelet. Very, very nice. Okay, so let's see here. Um, you guys, I still have 10 pieces for $30, 10 random mis um, mystery jewelry pieces. They are wearable, um, they are non craft. So, 10 random jewelry pieces for it includes shipping it for $30. Silver, no, 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 no. So, here we have some hearts they're acrylic and it's very very tiny probably for like um, a young child here's another earring okay I wonder if something's missing right there hmm we'll put that with the earrings silver you're blocking my my light girl no 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 scoot over Scoot your tush. Okay, so this is cute. This is, oh, this is actually a strip, like a craft strip. So this is going to go in the craft lot. So let's get these bangles out of the way. Bangles are a dime a dozen. But I do like to test if one is silver or gold. You never know. There's a twist. This one's not sticking. I'm going to check that one out. This one's sticking, but you know what? Look at how well this one is made. Any maker's mark? So it's a gold wash, but it's faded. So you see a little bit of a silver undertone. Yeah. And my cats, they're funny. Um, yeah, I don't, I don't know. We might have to test that one out. Here is a triangle earring. Here's another piece of quartz, clear crystal quartz. Here is, oh, look at this. This is a tie clip, and it has a, tr a truck on it. That's interesting. Very, very interesting. 
Ooh, I love this. I Okay, so I hope I have the pair to this earring. This is like a painting from, I don't know, I'm not going to guess. Like, This is a painting, so um, it kind of reminds me of like the Da Vinci era. I just love this though. This would be even cute to put as a charm on a bracelet. So romantic, I love this. And you guys, sorry, I apologize. That's my skin. I had it's chem. It's from the chemicals of testing. Um, silver and gold. So I need to test these out. Mm, I don't think this is silver. It has a nice cut on here. It's not sticking though. And then this one, let's see. Oh, the twist is inside. So this could have been homemade. I don't know. We'll see. So I hope everybody's having a good weekend. Oh, oh, you know, relaxing and whatnot. Okay. Yep, we are having a lot of earrings and thingamajiggers so hopefully this week when I go back to um, the community I could get some bags this last week I didn't get any bags there was there wasn't any oh they were gone so here's a pair of some silver tone but they have some wear on this side earrings here is a, okay, so what does this say? Godiva? Made in China. I don't know what this belongs to. Godiva is known for like their liqueur and chocolates. So what did this come on with? That's actually really nice. Very, very nice. Yeah, I don't know. Put that to the side. Here's a cute little bird. It's a charm. And it does have a print on the inside. It says KC on the inside of the bird kind of hard with the camera but I don't know what Casey is I can't really think Kentucky Fried Chicken no <laughs> I don't know so put that to the side I don't want to miss any of these loose pieces so here we have another religious um, pendant sometimes these are sterling and this one isn't. Here's a, a black, looks like a leaf kind of earring. Hopefully we could get the pair. Here's a really cute coral colored um, acrylic flower. Okay, so somebody made this, this ring like a dichroic glass. This part feels like plastic though. Here's another ring. Uh, this one's small and it has a copper undertone so it's not. That one's nice though. Very, very nice. Kind of, ma It's more on the masculine side but I, I really like masculine rings too. <gasps> oh look at how cute this one is it's a tiger's eye it might be silver it might be I'm gonna test it it might be silver here's a plastic um, purple flower ring there's another ring and it has what does it have on it it looks like a frog but the it's very very worn out 
Here's a little pin with two birdies, very cute. Here is a clip-on of um, some crystals, blue AB crystals. So maybe we could get the pair, if not, let's go ahead and craft. Here is a gold tone heart. It looks like a leaf, but in the shape of a heart. Hmm. Hopefully we get the pair to that one. Oh, these are really cute. Look at it's like transferware of flowers. Here's another earring. This is a <laughs> this is a wood piece. That's a big chunker. Um Oh, look at here's the other earring. So, I have the pair to that. Yes. Very, very nice. Let's move this over. If you guys hear a loud sound in the background, it's my, um, it is my air conditioner. It's warm today. Mm. Okay, so here we have a tangle. Okay, and this is an earring. Let's get this off. Okay, so these are charms of hearts. That's cute. And it looks like it's um, it could open up pretty wide. It looks like it would be comfortable. Kind of, those hearts are trying to emulate the Brighton, the Brighton style. Okay, this has missing stones. I don't think this is silver. Here we have a single shower earring. Very, very pretty. The carving. Here's another earring. Okay, so this earring is very, <laughs> is very bobbly. I appreciate it though. Let's get, hopefully we get that pair for that one. Here's a plastic blue stone ring. Probably for like a ch young child. It's very, very tiny. Okay, so this, there's a lot going on with this one. Okay, let's unhook this. And does this open up? No, but I'm trying to see what the pendant is. That's really pretty, the little pendant. It just has to, all this has to come off. <clears throat> I'll put that to the side. Okay. Here we go with an earring. And it has um, these little drops. I like the design. A little bit modernist. Hmm. I don't see any markings, but it might be a gold over silver. Mm. No, it's not. I'm just looking at it really closely. Here's another earring. Another, okay, this looks like it was a piece of an earring. Here is a gold earring. It's in very good condition. It's like really, really shiny, so I hope we get the other one on that one. Okay, so. Namaste. Namaste. Hmm. I don't know what that is. Man, it's not silver. Here's another chain, but it does have a lot of wear in it. <clears throat> Put that with craft. 
Um, let's see here. This looks like it was from an ornament, a Christmas ornament. Okay. Let me... Hmm. So it's just, it's a tangled, it's just, there's a bell, it looks like, oh, there we go, it's separated. It's a bell on a bracelet. Here's a uh, Hawaiian flower on a necklace. This is a, let me see, it doesn't look like there's much wear on this um, gold chain. Probably re save it, reuse it for pendants. Let me see here. So, yeah, I'm going to save that for um, loose pendants that I have. Here's another one of those bangles. Yeah, I'm seeing a lot of craft. Uh, this one's in bad condition, but I will save this. I like to save these. The backs of the earrings. Oh, look, here's the other earring. Great, that's good. Here is a single, hmm, nope, it's not nothing. It's not silver or gold, that's what I meant, like, it's not nothing. Here's another matching of those worn out triangle earrings. Gold, gold hoop, hopefully we have the pair on this one. Okay, so, this is a hot mess. single earring. Here's a rope. I'm going to put that in the trash. I can't even put that in craft. Okay, so here is what a Oh, no. It's falling out. The earring. Let's get it to go down. Okay. There we go. There's the earring with the shells. Okay, so this is a necklace, silver chain. Hmm. Like a dog chain. Juicy Couture makes a lot of these. Put that to the side. Ooh, this one has a lot of nice fire. Let's see here. See that? Are there marks on this? No, it's probably not silver, but that one's really nice. Very, very nice. Studs. Studs are my go-to. I like wear those every day, like even to the market. To the, those are just like my go-to, the studs. My Swarovski studs. Okay, so this is a hot mess. What is this though? Let me see this pendant. It says Republic. I cannot see that through the branch. Hmm. Kind of looks like a hieroglyphic, but I don't know. Okay. Yeah, this is... This is a hot mess. We're gonna put that to the side right there. Oh, I've had these before. These are actually really fun. Um, there's an anchor. It says love, infinity. I just want to make sure that the the pieces don't go flying everywhere. Okay, I'm. Um, here's a bangle. I like the inlay though of this. That's that's really nice. Oh, look at 
look at this heart. Look at the wire on this heart. These are cool. Or this one's cool. Hopefully I could get the the pair. Oh, you guys, look. Yes, I have the pair on this one. Very, very nice. Okay. So some do have pairs. Here's another, here's a knotted earring. Single. Okay, so here we have a brass um, cuff. I don't see no maker's mark, but it's very sturdy. Like, it's heavy. You could probably knock somebody in the head with that. Oh, jeez. So, these are missing stones. The pair's there, but they're missing stones. Ooh, yes. Okay, so I like these coin rings. They're fun. 1900. Okay, so we had the, the tie clip. We have a cuff link. Maybe we have the other cuff link. And there's no maker's mark. Here's one earring. It looks like a, a chemist a vial that they use. Like the shape of it. I know there's another name for it, but... Sometimes in the moment my brain's not working. So these are just like uh, silver hoops. Okay, so let's see here. We have some seed bead earrings, a bracelet. Here's the other earring. Okay, so oh, oh this one's all bent cheese. Okay, that one's gonna go on craft okay so where's the other earring matching earring seed bead stuff okay good we have the the other earring oh you know what I think it's missing something let me see here Yeah, it's missing a, a couple strands to be on. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. It's missing a strand. Okay, here's a wooden um, earring. I'm gonna take this off though, because I could use that. Here's another. Oh, here's a really cute. Um, ring with like a flower on it. Here's a gold, kind of like an abstract earring. It's very elongated, has a weird shape. Let's get these earrings out of the way. I appreciate that these are together. There's a single crystal earring. And we have bangle galore on that. Okay. So what do we have here? Oh, this is cute. It's like a druzy. I hope I have the other earring to this one. Okay, so here's another chain. And I'm gonna save this one. This says Austria. Oh, look at it's it's um needlepoint. Oh man, they didn't cover it up. They didn't cover it up. I wonder if this could be cleaned. Look right there. To think, um, somebody in um, Austria was sitting there, and it made its way all across the world. Unless somebody over here did it and then it's just smacked it on this piece that says Austria, but I don't think so. Okay, so here's another 
gold tone ring with like a kind of like a cameo silhouette there's the girl these are cute here's the other earring that I found earlier so these seem to have the pairs working for them here is a white twist silver it looks like um hmm it's, it's a silver tone it's not real silver but it's very um I'm trying to think of it's not stainless well it's like an unpolished stainless steel here's uh, another seed bead earring okay so this is a blue princess cut stone marcasite and it looks like yeah hopefully we have the pair on that one that would be fantastic here is a clip-on with this really black round piece of I don't know if it's wood or yeah it's wood mm, yeah. <clears throat> oh look at top of the mountain to ya <clears throat> happy happy past St. Patty's Day little pen that's cute and there is writing on the back it says made in <clears throat> probably Ireland nope it says made in Taiwan okay so that fooled me made in Taiwan so here we go this is actually fun okay this is a pendant go put a really thin chain through that here we have some stones I don't know what they are Jasper mm, I don't know we have the little dangles off of them yeah it's not silver but this one's really really pretty Oh, what do we have here? A piece of a watch. And this says SS. Let me look at the back. I can't even read through the camera. SS.com. Here we have a um, cuff link, really smooth black circle, kind of like an onyx, but it's, it's not, it feels lighter than that. Here is the other earring, so I could pair that up. Oh, look at this cuff link. Is this swank? Okay, so, um, yeah, this is Swank, and hopefully we get the pair, so I'll put that to the side. Oh, look at that. <laughs> look at this big earring. Okay, I don't know what this is, but maybe clouds in the sky. Yeah, we'll put that to the side. Here is, this is a big old chunker. I like the design, though ring <laughs> yeah okay let's see here okay so I'm starting to see here's the matching pair so jumbo $39 $39 for these earrings are these Gucci Chanel what's going on here I mean, they are vintage. Hmm. I don't know. I feel like maybe there's something special about those earrings. I don't know. 
So here we have a rose inlay. This reminds me of uh, Mexican candy that I used to get when I was a kid. We already seen this one. This one's a wood earring. And so yeah, it looks like this bag is gonna be predominantly earrings. Yes, look at this. So we have this. We're looking for the pair. And now we have the pair for these baubles. With DNA, I've seen hair. Okay. Here's the other earring, but it just has a lot of wear. I'm gonna put this with craft, or somebody could use this as a um, a drainer. Like, um, well, no, that's too big right there. A catcher for something, you know. This is actually cute. It's very, very cute. It's small. This is actually smaller than what I'm used to seeing, because if we look at this, is a regular standard bangle that's very small Juliana this is probably something that would fit your wrist we have the really cute pink seed bead and rectangle kinda has like a lustful pearl on the pink and okay I'm skipping I'm skipping here's another bangle Whoa, look at these earrings, but they're significantly, is it dirt or wear? No, there's wear. I probably could have used these. Okay. Um, let's see here. Hmm. Okay, so here's the other shell earring. Yay, because that works. That works out really well. Here is a, what do they call these, knuckle brass rings. has rhinestones. It's not going to fit me. I have big fingers. But, you know, you want, you want, some, you want some of this? To the moon. Bam! <laughs> I'm having too much fun with that. Okay. Um, okay, so let's move this over a smidge. Oh, I think I see a Betsy Johnson earring. Okay, here we have, um, this is really, really pretty. It's a crackled grain, um, enamel inlay on a silver tone pendant. And then we just have the seed bead, the teal seed beads with like the um, copper colored beads. Okay. Okay. Here we have a silver tone hoop with diamond cuts. And let's see if we could get it up. This would be, oh, okay, there we go. Hmm. It's very matted, so. Excuse me. Oh, excuse me. Sometimes the dirt from the jewelry, and then it's, for me, it's allergies. <clears throat> Starts to get me to sneeze. This one's really nice. I don't think it's silver. Let's just put it to the side. Here is a. Um, gold tone clip on. Hopefully, we could get the pair. Oh, look at this. So, this is a double ring and it's adjustable. It's adjustable. Let's see, we have flowers, amber colored stones, and actually, I would think this would be pretty as a pendant. Take these off and make this into a pendant. Right? What do you think, Marcena? I think you can make that into a pendant. Put that to the side. And... Okay, so we got a big old tangle monster. Hmm. But I'm looking at this thing right here. This is really, really cute. It's plastic. 
Look at the design. That's cute. I'm going to put that to. So, see, I could put that on this gold chain that I just saved. And voila, we got a necklace. Here is a gold tone um, earring. Oh, that snapped fast. That is not gold. <laughs> okay, here's another earring. Here is a beaded hoop earring. Oh, look at these ice style beads. I'm just trying to pull the earrings off. <clears throat> we have a <clears throat> kind of like an 80s design with the teal on it. Oh, these are signs. These are signs, baby. Uh, is this Laura Birch? Lori Birch? Yep, Laura Birch, and it says Ed on, so hopefully we could get the other one, because um, her earrings um, can sell for some decent money, you know? Here's another earring. Oh, this is a very, very cool design. Very, very cool. Are you silver? Might be. We're gonna test you out. Well, that's for sure. Let's get this out of here. This is a very, very. So you're attached to all this mess. Oh my god. Okay. Let's see here. Is this together with this one? Yes, it is. But it's busted. So hold on. Okay. So here we have. I'm gonna have to figure this one out. Here we have a silver um, earring. I don't think this is real silver though. And we'll test that one out. Here's an earring, rhinestone. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Here is a very dirty, maybe worn out. Silver chain. I'm trying to see if I see an undertone. It is really, really dirty. Yeah, it's not real. Sometimes when they're so dirty, but they're more blackened, um, they will be silver. Okay, so wait a minute. That earring is missing. No, they're different. Yeah, no, they're the same. Wait, no, they're different colors. We'll test those. We will test those out. This looks like you missed the stone here. So I've been really, really wanting, and I think I'll have more time this summer since my son's out of school and it's freeing up a lot of my time. But I've been really wanting, this is really cute, this bracelet. Um, I don't know if this is puka shells or hishi shells, whatever you call them, with the little stones, tiger's eye. So I've been really wanting to do like an get get into um, an antique booth. I just have to go do some research and actually get inventory for that because you know I'm I'm gonna just have a very small small spot, but. If it's not selling, then it's not going to be worth it for me. So here we have these green stones, peridot. And I don't know if they're real. But I appreciate it. Look at that. So beautiful, that green. Lately, actually for a while now, I've been really into greens lately. Okay, so, are, are we all part of this, okay, this one, that earring goes to the side, is this all the same necklace? 
Let me see here. Where's the... Okay, so I released that. Um... Hmm. I'm trying to see if these are all connected. This one's really cute. I know, guys. Sorry, you don't want to see me here. Okay, so let me see here. So this is all connected. Yeah, this is, well, it does, I don't think this one's connected. Sometimes when they just throw these in the lots, uh, deep, deep within, you'll get like a silver chain or a gold chain. Uh, I don't remember finding a gold one, gold filled, but a lot of silver. Okay, so, what in the haberdashery? And then sometimes I just use this to pull out other chains to like loosen it up. <clears throat> I don't think we got time for this, right folks? <laughs> this is uh, welcome to the world of, man, of jewelry hauls. Okay. Oh, it looks like it's this is another necklace and it's in here. Tangled or it could be yeah, I feel defeated right now with this one. Okay, we're going to move you to the side. And then this one got almost lost, but this is a really, really cute, um, I don't know, if, yeah, I guess this is an earring, or, yeah, it's an earring, very, little cross, look how, look how cutie patootie that one is. Oh, you guys, look, here's the other earring, so I have the pair, yes, or a birch, if anybody wants that, email me. Um... Mm, this one's cute too. Yeah, I don't think that's silver, but I like that design. Look at that. Really, really cool. Okay, here we have a koala with a blue cabochon. Sometimes you gotta be careful with these stick pens. Um, and they could be gold filled. So, let's see what we have here. Hmm. I'm trying to see if this is silver or blackened. Oh, okay, so here, this is this is the necklace. This is what, really cute. Yeah, it's not silver, it's just the metal. But she's cute. Um, you know, kind of reminds me of, uh, no, I don't want to say it because it's not really that, that style. Here are some bangles. Alright guys, so we're down towards the bottom. And here is, ooh, this feels nice. Who is this? Feels like Butter. They're just loose in large caviar beads, silver tone, and they're articulated. They feel really nice though. Okay, so I have the pair on that. So earlier I had this piece, alpaca, but 
I'm missing the the part that goes in the you well this could actually could be a um a pendant of some sort you know I don't know what this is if this is a ring or what's going on so here we have blue little earrings rhinestone heart I'm trying to see if there's a hole for hmm Here's an earring. Here's the other wooden wooden earring. Oh, look at this carved little guy. What is this, a ram? He's cute. It's like a jade-like stone, but I don't, ooh, look at this one. Very aztec -y. Aztec. Oh my god, I just... Did I just fling? No, it's still there. Oh god, this is strong. Okay, so hopefully we could get the other earring on this one. Little faux pearls. This one is sticking, so it's not any precious metal. Here we have a skeleton. Okay, here we have the other rose pair. Ooh, very, very vintage -y. I like it. On wood. And we are at, we are down to the nitty gritty. Ooh, look at these. These stones, wood, or, I thought these were, okay, this is nice. I thought these were wood beads. No, these are, st ooh, look at this. What is going on here? So, okay. Let me see. I'm trying to figure this out. It looks like, oh, they just clipped that on right there. That doesn't go on there. So the clasp needs to be fixed. Look at all those different stones. Look at all pretty the rich stones are we have like cranberry colored some yellow green tones beige oh they feel so nice okay are these like different jasper look at look at the cranberry color on that one so Hmm. I think there is a missing. I don't know what's missing. It's very, very confusing. This this would be great for somebody just to revamp and fix. I'm gonna put that to the side. Cause it just needs some TLC. Here's the other skeleton earring. Here we have a gold and teal earring. Oh, look at we have the pair to this one. Very, very nice. <gasps> yes, we have the other heart earring on this one. Happy about that. So there are a lot of pairs in here. Thank, thank God for that. Oh, there goes a motorcycle. Okay, so this, hmm. I don't know if this was added or if this is original. This. There's no wear on the the gold links itself. The wear is back here probably because of the sweat glands and whatnot. Somebody wore it or it was added after. No, this is original. But this one's cute. If your hair's down, you're not going to see that. That'll work, you know. 
What is this? Oh, this is nice. Look at the inlay with those purples and the abalone. Yes, I love that one. Okay. Oh, so we have another one of those. So they must have made a production of these. Here we have a birdie. And what are you? Are you like a ornament? So this bird ornament. Reach high for every dream. That is really cute. And it's in good condition. Very, very cute. It has a cross, a flower, a um, faceted... I think this is plastic right here. Yeah, it's plastic. This is really cute. Okay. <clears throat> I got st I got stuck on that bird. Here we have a Christmas brooch. Actually, I should have put this on. Put this on. Okay. So here's a. Mediterranean style earring. Really cool. Everything's there. It looks like it's missing at an angle. The the flattened beads, but they're not. Um, here's a ring. I have one very, very similar to this one. It has so much wear on it though. It's bad. Oh, okay. Here we have yellow inlay. I think something fell off of that earring. Okay. <gasps> you guys, look at this. We have the heart, the other heart. It's metal, but it's kind of like a wicker um, wrap. This is a pendant. So I have actually earrings that match this identical flower. This is kind of like a celluloid material. Here is a rose gold um, earring. Let me see, is this an initial or? We're missing some stones on this one. Here's the other knot of that earring. And the inlay on this wore off. It looks like this was added. Let me see here. I was trying to double check to make sure it's on silver, but yeah. Another earring. This one we found earlier in the bag. Here's a pendant. The black stone. Okay, I think that was the original um, earring. Oh, look at this. It's a it's a angel wing. You would have to fit somebody's fingers over here, but. Hmm. Bangles. Here's an angel pendant. Holding a glass. Maybe somebody's can communion or um, baptismal okay so I'm grabbing stuff and I'm not done there's just a lot of little loose pieces oh look at this earring okay this reminds me of like Mexico Aztec okay this is most likely a Betsy Johnson um, 
earring, but it has significant wear on it. Okay, um, I don't know what that came from. It's a ring. I don't think it's... Mm, we'll test it for silver. We found this earring earlier. Test that. Here's some... What are these? River Pearl turquoise um, earring. Okay, I'm going to put this one in trash. That one's just bad. Single um, white pin or earring. Ooh, look at this. This is a kite or trillion cut. Let me see if this is on gold or um, silver. So the the backing of the earring says 925 and uh, this might be silver. This little earring. I don't know where my diamond tester is at. As you can tell, I just test all the time for diamonds, right? This looks like it's marked for silver, but I don't know. Let me get this out. Here's the other earring with the shells. Okay, so this has to get tested. This is a craft piece. Okay. So this is the part where I love where they just throw it in because... Okay, here we go. Here we go. Uh, this might be silver. You guys, this one's going to be a long video. I had a feeling with all these little loose pieces. Yeah, so this, sorry. This says Italian 925. Test that out. So, I don't think this is gold. F. I actually like the chain to use. I think I'm going to keep the chain. I can't get it out. I can't get it out of the chain. Because it's, it won't, I'd have to break the F. Oh, that one's thick. F for fun. F for fantastic. F for Fanny. Right? Okay, so this was one of the earrings I found earlier. There's the pair to that one. Is this silver? Let me see here. I think so. She is tore back though. This might be an older piece. Hmm. It just says 8-8. Eight, eight. I don't know what that means. We'll test. We'll test that one. Okay, so I think this is just a worn out chain. Yeah. Okay. Oh, here's the other earring. Oh, no. So I'm missing that. Pooey. Now that's an easy fix for somebody who has like all those pieces and you know they fix jewelry. Okay, so I have two pairs. <laughs> two pairs of these original, one of a kind, authentic 
Da Vinci painting. Yeah, no, they're not original or one of a kind. I have two pairs. But if somebody, um, if I had two people who like them, then that'll work, you know? So this has, um, now that I'm looking at it, I do not think these are silver. These have like a brass undertone wash. Oh, you know what? They came in different colors. So I have like a brass and a silver. Are they the same? Let me look through the camera. No, they're the same. One's just more faded, I guess. So this is actually really cute. It's a pink stone. So, okay, put that to the side. Okay. Ooh, look at this cloisonne earring style. Silver with the lime grain and white stripe earring. <gasps> Look at how cute this one is. Oh my god, I hope I have the other one. Alright guys, let me untangle this and come right back because... Well, we got this pair. Very cute. Let me untangle this. Okay, so this is all one necklace and it's it's unlinked and I'm just going to put that to the side and craft. But I did get these earrings out. Very, very cute. A green heart. This is another type of stone. I don't know what it is though. Wait a minute. This isn't a stone. It's peeling. This is a stone though. It's like a green heart. It has the characteristics of jade, but I'm not, I don't know. Here is a Christmas pen. Very cute with the bells. This is just a, a silver single. Look at the, look at how many earrings I have of these. Wowzer. Here is a snake ring. And it has like little rhinestones on it. This one's really cute. We found this um, earring earlier, so I have the pair to that one. Yes. Now. Okay. So a bunch of earrings, it looks like, went under the stone. My the one I film on. Just trying to get them. Okay, so I have another bracelet. There's double with these hearts. Okay, this is plastic. This isn't real tiger's eye. It's a ring. Here's a cute clippy. Is there one like this to match it? I don't see it. We'll put it right there. If not, it's going in craft. Okay, so here we have a gray bangle. The enamel's still good on there. So this is a cherub. Oh, it's a pen. Who's this? Hidden hearts. Hidden hearts. Look at how cute. I love cherub. When I was young, I used to collect angels and cherubs. Have them all over my room. Those were the days. Here's a, um, what appears to be, like, different shades of ambers on this earring. But it's very, very worn out the earring you can just tell like oh wow look at that all the stones are still there 
Oh, that's kind of disappointing, you know? So here we have a mesh um, necklace of some sort. Okay, so here we're coming down to, this might be silver. We're gonna test this one out, I think it's silver. Okay, we're done with these pairs. There's there's too many of them. Oh, they really wanted to get rid of all these. Okay, so here we have it looks like a hematite stone, but it's it's like a glass of some sort. Get the faceted on that one. Like black. Is it black or gray? I can't tell. Okay, we'll put that to the side. This one's another pendant of like palm trees. This is really, really cute. On plastic. Here's a stretch ring. Here's the other earring of um, the worn out Betsy Johnson. So this one on something, it's not even real stone, it's plastic. Trying not to like this looks like it's just gonna jump everywhere. I'm just pulling up all the little faux pearls. Here's one earring with some faux peridots. Hopefully, the other one is intact. Let me see here. Yep. She is good to go. All right. Cool on the pairs. Okay. I'm not seeing the matching one to this one. There. Now I have been invaded with all these multiple <laughs> earrings. Here is a... Oh, this is cute. Look at how cute that is. It's an angel with little... Pearl feet. That is so cute. Oh, I'm going to put that. I'm going to put that to the side. Yep, here's another one. We've been invaded, guys. <laughs> here's a ring, but it has it's worn out. It has the copper undertone. We found this earring earlier. We have the matching me. Oh, yes, we have this one. This one's really cute. The vintage. Um, we found like this earlier, but this one is missing a little point. Here's a bead. Now these, are you silver? No. But you're in very good condition. These are like twisted silver little hoops. Girl, okay, look at you. Yes, honey. This reminds me of like the Victorian era, the way they would cluster their jewelry and the design. Beautiful. There is wear on the bottom, but you can't see it. Let me see, are all the stones there? Yep. She's fun. She is fun, I like that one. So here is a, okay, so this is a pendant, a faux pearl. Wait a minute, is this a shell? I think it's a shell. It's a pendant. Here's the other one, but this one's bent really bad. Okay, um, I don't know if we got this earlier. Hmm. I'll put that to the side. I'm not too sure. Okay, so these are matching pairs. These are fun. Checkered, mint green, and cream. Did anybody have growing up a checkered 
or maybe solid mint green tile bathroom. I remember growing up and go to, going to family members and they had the pink tiles in the bathroom. Now, we, sometimes people go in, in a bathroom like that and it, you know, it's like, oh, it's outdated. It's from the 60s, the 50s. But to be honest with you, th those tiles, they hold up. Like, they hold up, and I wouldn't mind, mind having pink tiles. That's another one of those earrings. Here's a pair of gold. Um, gold earrings. There is some wear on them a little bit. Not too bad. We'll pair them up together like this. Okay. Okay, so here's a clippy. And is there a maker's mark? No, but here's the other one. So we'll leave these together. This is cute. I don't see the other pair. Mm -mm -mm. Oh, here's another bird. I wonder if those were earrings. Just put that to the side just in case. So now uh, it's just come down to, to this stuff. And now I'm just trying to find pairs and whatnot. It's a bracelet stretch. Oh, this is pretty. What color is this? So this is a blackened metal. So these are amber stones. Wow. Nice. Very nice. I love it. Here is, um, what is this? Like a dolphin? Dolphin fins? Charm? We have the matching pair on these little twisty earrings. I'm trying to see if I have the other rows to this one. I don't think so. Hmm. I don't think so. What is this? This looks like it might be. So this says 1 20th of um, 12 gold filled, 12 karat gold filled. Look at that. 12 karat gold filled. And it is a Scorpio. What is going on? Oh my God! Look at how cute! It's a, it's a baby. There's a bear. There are little, um, ballet flats. Is there another one? No. Are these marked? These are not marked. Let's see. Like, I think these are sterling, guys. Wow. Look at this. <laughs> Like, come on, a baby. I know some people may think, like, oh, that's kind of creepy. Look at the little tushy. Oh, it's not. Okay, there it is. <laughs> Their bags are always so very interesting. I got to get some more bags. I got to go beat whoever else is in line. Okay, so here we have a dragster um, charm. No, I don't think this is silver. You know, but it's still cool. And let's see here. Here's an earring. So these are just all like, okay, so here's the pearl. Hmm. It might be silver. I just have to, it's, uh, I don't know. 
it's it's kind of bending too easy we'll test it just in case now this rose is really cute and I'm kind of bummed there's only one hmm this earring too it's going over there all right so you guys we're we're oof. we are this is a very long video so what I'm going to do with these, just to make sure um, they're not gold or silver or anything like that, I'm just going to start doing that. Okay, so yeah, this one definitely, that one's pretty, that heart. Uh, there's no, okay. Okay, so I'm going to clean this up. I'm going to weed out what may possibly be silver, gold. This may be silver. Yeah, it's stamped. I think that's silver. So let me weed this out and I'm going to set up to test for silver, possibly gold. Okay, we're going to speed through this because I'm already at an hour and a half. And I'm going to drag this to see if... If this is silver. <sighs> this one's a little bit hard. Oh, this one's... This one's a little bit hard too. Because especially when they're on a thin... Okay, I'm not seeing a chain that I had earlier. Hmm. Oh no, I think I mixed it up. Oh well, I had a chain earlier. Okay, well let's just do this. might not be silver this one just like bent so yeah I don't know is this the one that okay so maybe this is the one I was thinking of so let's test this is this one this one I'm not gonna test I won't test every uh, I don't know we'll see so let's test the baby It might just be nickel. I don't know. Let's test the shoes. The ballet shoes. Let's test the bear. Test the heart. And let's ah let's just test this one. I'm gonna I'll test these after. Mm, I don't think this one's silver. It's giving me like that white. Might be nickel. Everything's coming up as positive. Wow. So everything is silver. Okay, folks. I'll see you guys on the next one. Thanks for tuning in. And if you made it this long in the video, I appreciate it. 
Hopefully I could upload a video tomorrow. If not, I'll see you guys next week. Soho California Vintage, signing off.